Hey guys, welcome back to another video here. It's um, Blizzardfur, and basically, we're going to be uh, playing, uh, well, Eaglercraft, but I'm going to be showing off some interesting things with Eaglercraft. Eaglercraft is a version of um, Minecraft uh, Java Edition that's compiled with TVM into JavaScript. So now that you've got that in your picture, I, there's some differences in this code that changes how the game appears in some aspects, and I'm going to show this off. So, in creating a new world, as you can hear, the audio is compressed. Um, I've I've hacked some single-player commands into this version because this version doesn't normally have commands. Even though it's not shown here, I added my own custom command, which is fly, which allows me to fly. Um, and you know, and you know, you can use other commands like give to give yourself, you know, whatever you want, farmland, and all that, you know. As you can hear, it's very compressed, the audio. Um, yeah. So now let's show you the one thing I wanted to show off, which was interesting, This, which is the Farlands. Which is, um, Tully, 12,550,800 in one direction, and then... And this will take a second, because it's got to load a bunch of stuff in the browser. But once you're teleported here, you'll notice this looks sort of like the normal Farlands. However, when you go above, look at that. It's like that on all angles, vertically and non-vertically. So that's a very nifty thing, as you can see. And you can go out a little further. And yeah. Give it a second. Because it's 30 million blocks. It also might have just crashed, so... Yeah, I think we just crashed. So, let's, um... Developer tools, yeah. See, we crashed. Um... So, yeah. As you can see, that world is now corrupted. So I think that's going to conclude our um, gameplay. Well, the world isn't corrupted, but it's going to include our gameplay. That shows off the Farlands in good detail and whatnot. So yeah, very cool.